Hello, my name is Ashani Johnson Turbis. I am the director of NARC's Center on Equity Research. Welcome to Equity Core, a video series where we feature people doing important work to advance equity through social science research. Today, we are joined by Warren Jones. Warren, can you start by just telling us a little bit about your role and what you do at NORC? Yes, my name is Warren Jones. I am a production manager within TSSO, that's the Telephone Survey and Support Operations Department here at NORC. As a production manager, I manage uh, various research projects and help to ensure that the methodology, data collection methodology that we use um, appropriately addresses the needs of the diverse populations in which we collect data from. I'm particularly curious about how your professional and or academic experience has shaped how you approach and how you think about advancing equity in the work that you do. You know, I think in terms of my overall experience, this is a new arena for me. Uh, this really started, I would say, in the summer of 2020. Um, you know, as we know, uh, on the on the heels of the death of George Floyd, um, and specifically how we responded uh, to that um, as a company, that really started my involvement. Um, being a part of the original DREI committee that started our initiatives here at NRC, that really was the um, the impetus for my involvement. Yeah. No, that's excellent. Um... I think that your story is, is similar to many other people who were motivated by um, what was happening in the country and in the world in 2020. So thank you for sharing that. What about your personal identity? Can you say a little bit about how your personal identity has shaped how you think about and your approach to inclusive and equitable research? Sure. Um, you know, I think for me, that goes back to my roots, um, and I'll be as brief as I can. Um, you know, I'm the son of two educators. Uh, my parents were college educated, but I am the grandson of sharecroppers uh, from a small rural town in North Carolina. Uh, grandfather had an eighth grade education. My grandmother was a hairdresser by trade and also assisted, you know, uh, on the farm. They didn't have access to, you know, the necessary um, resources. They didn't always have the opportunities that other people had. The equity piece recognizes that we all have, you know, come from different backgrounds. We have different lived experiences, mm -hmm. but, you know, the equity piece works to ensure that, um, you know, the people that are, I guess, underserved uh, have access to those opportunities. Um, and a chance to achieve an equal outcome. So that's definitely what is what has shaped me. Yeah, no, that's excellent. Thank you, Warren. I love the language that you used about acknowledging people's lived experience. I think that has become something that's very important in the work that we do as well to advance equity. Take a moment and just think about one word. If you could say in one word what you think needs to happen next, to really sort of embrace and advance inclusive and equitable research, particularly in the work that you do in TSSO, what would that word be? And I'm gonna borrow this expression from a colleague of mine. Uh, I think this is God's work, right? Mm -hmm. um, it's, it's bigger than just having conversations and understanding uh, between people. It's really changing mindsets and mm -hmm thought processes. Um, you know, it's a change that, that we have to em embrace and be all in on. That's wonderful. Thank you so much, Warren. We so appreciate having you on NORC Equity Corp. Thank you for your time today. Thank you for having me.